Um, I'm not surprised. In fact, Donald Trump brags about using litigation to intimidate people. He's trying to silence me. He's afraid of what I would share. And that's why you see these actions from Donald Trump. There are very distinct ways that we're different. One, I want to see this nation united as opposed to divided. I don't want to see a race war as Donald Trump does. I'd like to see things happen for the communities of Chicago and Flint, as we talked about on the campaign, to see the rebuilding of Puerto Rico. I actually like to see the inner city youth get the educational tools that they need and the funding that they need. And I'd like to see Americans continue to have health care as opposed to watching him dismantle it. He, instead of doing the work to advance the American agenda and policy and helping people have a robust life, he's actually taken more time out, in fact, sending nine, ten tweets, I don't know the count, um, to attack, insult, and to silence me. It makes me very, very concerned, and I think all Americans should be concerned that the United States president would behave this way and would be so consumed with someone that he cannot continue to fulfill the duties of this office. He is unfit, he is mentally impaired, and he is doing damage to the republic. I have been gone for seven months, and so if it were true that I was blocking you know, people from getting in the White House, why hasn't there been an increased diversity since I've left? Since people saying I was the um, hold up, it's because they have no commitment, no true commitment to seeing diversity in this White House. There's no excuse that there's not another African American assistant to the president. No excuse whatsoever. At every single opportunity, he insults African Americans. He insults the intelligence of African Americans. After LeBron James, who's from my home state of Ohio, in fact, his school is just 45 minutes from where I grew up. After he worked to try to bring educational opportunities for his community, Donald Trump didn't share those efforts. In fact, he tore them down. He wants to divide this nation. He wants to pit his base against successful African-American, particularly men you see him attacking, athletes, uh, fe females like um, Maxine Waters, where he encourages people to attack her over and over again. He uses his rally, rallies to really encourage people to bring down African-Americans.